Listen, all you New Yorkers. Starting off today's episode, I wanted to start with something that I think everyone should be doing. You should be doing it. I hope you're doing it. If you're not doing it, then you should start doing it. That is planning ahead. Today is Thursday. I don't know when you're watching this, but today is Thursday. Now, last no, two weeks before this week, I knew that Labor Day was coming up. Labor Day is going to be on Monday. So I had the genius idea of taking off Thursday and Friday so that I can have Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday at off. Have those five days off. Because I've been running around, I've been doing a lot, and I'm just tired. I haven't been going to the gym. I've just been doing work with YouTube and a lot of other things, and I just need a little bit of time off or just to catch up and get ahead of other work so I can relax and, well not relax, but be okay with doing other work. Re really just not running myself too, too ragged. They call it Bernie the Candle at both ends. That's what they say. I don't say it, but I've heard my mom say it before. It's a good saying, so I thought I'd steal it. Thanks, mom. I've heard this so much, people saying, oh, I'm more of a go with the flow type of person. I just go with the wind. I'm spontaneous. Being spontaneous is just, you know, a spur of the moment type thing. It shouldn't be your life goal to just be spontaneous all the time because then you're never going to get anything done. And if you do get something done, it's just going to be half <laughs> What I like to do, I love to make a list. Even at work, I have like a bunch of sticky notes. Well, not a bunch, but maybe like three or four sticky notes with just things I need to do for the day, for work, for personal, like whether it be call my mom or call my brother or my sister or something like that. And then for outside of work, I make those lists and then I just cross it off as I go. And if I don't cross it off for the day, I carry it over to the next day. Make lists. Look, I'm not trying to be your mom or your dad, but I am saying I know for a fact that when you plan, you get a lot more done, meaning you accomplish more goals, meaning you get more out of life, whether that be money, time, or resources. How's this mic sound? This is the mic I've been using for a while, then I stopped using it, now I'm using it again. I don't know. We'll see you tomorrow. Hey, just popping in really quick. Sorry about that fuzzy thing that's in the corner. That is the wind sock for the microphone so that you don't hear a bunch of wind whizzing over the microphone if I'm running or going outside or something like that. Just wanted to pop in and say that. I, I took it off so you won't see that anymore. Let's get back to the episode. Now I'm heading out to do some pressure washing and I got this job because I planned it. like it might rain I didn't plan for this for those of you thinking about getting into pressure washing you don't need fancy chemicals I use this is the stuff you use for pool cleaning put this into your pool gets rid of the algae or whatever like that that's the only thing I use this and a little bit of soap that's it this bottle right here three dollars you're welcome. right now that's 21 so we're where's all 20 yet man I'm about to burn this place down 19 22 
21. This is not 20. This is not 20, and I know that because whatever's supposed to be on aisle 20 isn't this. Let me ask somebody. After about 35 minutes, I found them. Now I just have to find my size. So I changed my mind. These are a little bit too tight, so I'm waiting for somebody in lumber to come and tell me if they have a size 11. I wear a size 13 shoe, but naturally these run big, so I need like an 11. But this is a 10, a little bit too snug. I don't think anybody's coming. I'm cutting it close because I have that pressure washing job to be at 11, but look what I found. Halloween decorations already out. This guy's amazing. You're scary, sir. <laughs> You're scary. Time to get some food. Just coming back from my second job. I didn't record that one just because I was just trying to get in and out before it started raining. I didn't stop to get food because I was just trying to hurry up and get home. My clothes are wet. I just wanted to get out of these clothes. I'm not sweaty. It was a cool day. I'm just just damp, just wet. So I'm gonna eat my favorite thing, chicken nuggets. I know I'm a grown up, but they're just so tasty. Oh my. While I'm waiting for my nuggets to get finished, if you've made it this far, comment down in the section, real one, so I know who all the real ones are. Another thing, everybody's asking about the giveaway, but uh, these views are looking low. So this is how I'm gonna do the keywords now one. I'm just gonna say them randomly in a video. Just so happens, it's gonna be at the end of this video. So we're not gonna do cash on Xbox. You guys love these Playstations. I don't blame you. As you can see, I got my Playstation hooked up, baby. Ready to watch some flicks. Play some Call of Duty. Okay, that's not the point. So, we're doing a PlayStation 4 giveaway. First keyword is water. You're welcome if you made it this far. Don't forget to comment down real one. And I will see you on tomorrow's vlog. I've been waiting for like 30 minutes and I came back to check. And I didn't even turn the oven on. Ryan.